Okay, so I f have figured out how to make uh, global changes to the MIDI files uh, so that they can play back at all the same volume. Um, and it, this is more of a workaround than anything else. So let me first tell you that uh, what I'm doing is I'm just using an external DAW to control the SD90. Uh, so you'll have to figure out how to do this uh, based on what DAW you're using. I'm using Logic. I'm very familiar with it. So it was very easy for me to set this up. But essentially, the way this works is you'll go ahead and you'll go into your MIDI file. And let's say you'll load something and you'll listen to it. Right? And we'll look at the volumes that are on it. And let's say that you want it uh, a little bit louder. Okay, So I can go ahead and I can adjust the volume here and you'll see that it's adjusting all the tracks at the exact same time keeping the relative volume differences between the tracks the whole time right? when I get to the maximum value on a track at 127 it'll stay there and the other ones will start to come up but once I get below the 127 you keep the relative volumes between all the channels so as you can see I have one fader that controls all the channels. So what this allows me to do is that I have the ability to now make volume changes to all 16 tracks at one time. And when I like it, then of course, I would just press save, and I would save those parameters, and then it would be logged up. And then I would go ahead and grab the next MIDI file. So let's go ahead and do that real quick. Uh, let's, take, uh, let's take another one. So let's say I go down here and I take, uh, I, I don't know what we have here. We'll take this one, right? And again, I'll just go in and look at the mixer. Now I can make changes. I can lower it if it's too loud, or I can bring it up if it's not loud enough. Once I get it where I want it, then I can press save and go ahead and save it. Okay, I hope that gives you an idea of a possible way to be able to control and normalize all of your MIDI files fairly quickly and easily using one fader.